Hey, hey, it's around here. In this tech tutorial, I'm going to show you how to sell a specific portion of your course in System IO. And this particular option is a feature which is applicable if you want to, for example, offer a fast action bonus to people when they sign up, or if you want to sell only pieces of your signature course, not the whole thing as sort of a cheaper option, things along these lines. So let me show you how that's done. So I'm going to use an order form that I'm no longer using because it was an old order form. And I'm going to use a demo course, which is this one, Client Acquisition, just because I have a lot of modules here. Now you'll notice here, when you look at the module, each one of these ones is its own standalone module. Now what you can do is, let's just say that I'm going to go right here and on the order form, I say when somebody makes a purchase, I'm going to add a resource and I'm going to add a course and then I'm going to pick the client acquisition course in this case. So let me just find it. So there you go, client acquisition course. Now you will notice here that I can choose the course type. Do I want partial access, full access, drip content? The difference is that drip content means that you give them access little by little. So when you click on it, you'll notice um, it will, you can give it access at a specific date. So if you're doing a specific launch, for example, where it's a cohort where three times of the year you do a group thing, then you will give them access at a specific point. Now, in this case, I'm going to look at the next option, which is partial access. And you will notice that every one of the modules is now a resource I can give. Now, I can now click on the ones, the modules that people are going to get as part of it, okay? So I'm gonna choose all of these as an option. And I can also choose a couple other things. Again, I can choose to give them access at a specific time or a specific day. And also I can do it so it's more like renting the course where they get something valid for a certain amount of days. So when I did my templates and coaching membership recently, I gave two bonuses and I gave 30 day access to those bonuses. And um, that's what I did. So, and once the 30 day hit, it basically expired. Now in this case, notice that these are going to be, um, one, those that are not ticked, they're not gonna get access to this, okay? So now the question is, let's just say somebody does buy, but they then log into the members area and they're like, hang on, how do I get access to the rest of them? So here's what you can do. You can click right here on over the shoulder tutorial, let's just say, which is this module, which you'll notice here, they don't have access to it. Oh yeah, they do. So case studies, other people's case studies or whatever, right? So let's just say it's this one, the case studies one, they don't get access. So you would click on settings and now you can choose a specific funnel or order form where they can actually go and click to be able to sign up for it. So now I don't have a sales page set up for it, but let's just pretend that I have another order form right here, then you would click here and you would go to, and this one is from this funnel. So let me just find it. So there you go, this one. And then you'll be able to choose a, either a sales page or an order form. Okay, so I'm gonna pick on the sales page, for example. And now if somebody doesn't get access to this module, then because they didn't buy the correct price or they bought it at a specific point once it's expired, then they will, once they're in the members area, they will see the buy now button for the specific module, basically. So this is something where you can do where for a specific module, you can actually customize that people can buy something. So have a look here. Um, the URL in the buy button will lead to the sales page. Okay. So that's what that would look like. Okay. Now in this case, I'm just move this because that's not meant to be, but that's how you would actually sell partial access to whatever course you are selling. So hope that's helpful. I have a, a more detailed tutorial on cross sales as well, where you can actually sell full courses that are in your storefront. If you want to check it out, it's going to be somewhere around this video. And if you have another tutorial that you'd like me to do to do a system IO, leave a comment below of any questions you have. And if you get value from this tutorial, please leave the word value just so I know that this video was helpful to you. If you have any questions, let me know. Looking forward to hearing from you and I'll speak to you soon. Cheers. Thanks a lot for watching this tutorial. I really appreciate it. So if you have not used system or haven't tested it out, you can actually create a free account. You're missing out big time. It is a great software. And all you gotta do is go to aranbukai.com forward slash SIO. That will take you to the system page. You enter your email, you create a free account, take it to a test drive. 
And when you feel confident like you're ready to go and this is a good tool, the pricing is simply $27 a month or you can also get $197 a year, which is pricing is not available on their website, but I have a special link for that if you wanna take advantage of it. It's actually 10 times cheaper than the bigger competitors and so on, and it's a really good plan. So if you wanna check it out, uh, go to rambukai.com forward slash SIO, and let me know once you had a bit of a look around. Uh, that's about it. If you have any other questions or tutorials that you'd like me to make on System IO, definitely let me know. Leave a comment below. I will do my best to get back to you as soon as possible. And uh, that's about it. Thanks. I'll speak to you soon.